Good day, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my home in Livingston, Montana. Now, today is August 14th of 2020, and I got something I want to show you here, so hang on with me. Okay, right here, I'm going to give a shout out to this ammunition right here. It's it's put together, let me make sure I'm in focus because this thing has trouble with that. There we go. This stuff right here is put together in Stevensville, Montana. It's called 406 Ammunition. This is bulk ammunition. You can see that price right there. I give $115.99 for 250 AC, 45 ACP rounds. It's good stuff. I've, I've tested this ammunition over and over and over again, and I like it because it's relatively cheap. Let me get this stupid thing out of my way. And, there's about, I don't know, 200 rounds in there because I've, I've delved in, you know, and I've shot quite a few. Actually, I've been shooting lots of ammunition lately, but I just ain't been recording anything. So I just thought I'd, you know, give a shout out and no, I don't work for these people. No, I'm not, you know, I'm not sponsored by them, but you'll have to look up their address on the internet. I don't have it hand, handy, but... Oh, yeah, there it is, 406ammo.com. And they will ship directly to your home. That's what they told me anyway. Okay, let me put this away. Now, here's some extra foam right here. That's going to come into play here in a minute. This right here is a two-pistol uh, vault. It's a Pelican vault case. Okay, it's made out of Kevlar, I do believe. Pretty nice case, but I just thought I'd show you this real quick. Like, got some really nice latches here. It's kind of expensive, not real expensive. You can get these for about 60 bucks or so. And I've got two burner pistols, <laughs> what I call burner pistols, river pistols, you know, gangster pistols, high points. This guy right here is my 40, my 40 Smith & Wesson. And this is my newer one. This is my 45 ACP. And I put, you know, since the last file I've done, I put different grips on this thing just because I like to mess around with stuff. And she works pretty good with that 406 ammunition. That's what I'm trying to say. So there you are with how I carry those pistols in this case. And this is... Like I say, it's a Pelican 200 case. It was really made for two pistols. I don't have cutouts because I just don't need them. Okay, let me get these out of the way and show you what's in the bottom of this. Well, let me, let me set that aside and show you right here where the lid's at. Here's a nippy little idea for some of you folks that might be looking for stuff. You can keep some, you know, targets right there. And that's what I do, okay? Keep some targets in, in, back in there. Now, you take this foam off right here. Of course, this foam is very important to protecting all this wonderful stuff. And in here, you can see I got lots of clips. These orange ones right here are 45 ACP, okay? There's three of them. I own to a total of four. 45 ACP clips. Over here, it's 40 Smith & Wesson. Uh, the, the, the followers right here are green. That's how you can tell the difference. In other words, you know, right there. These are orange. <laughs> These are loaded too, by the way. These ones over here aren't. And the only cutting that I had to do, oh, and this is a little toolbox I put together just for, you know, for the heck of it, because it fits in here pretty good, pretty well, excuse me. But the only cutting I did was right here to get this to fit in there. And then I cut another uh, another square piece right there. <laughs> I need more hands to, to bring this ammo box up, to raise it up. You follow what I'm saying? Yeah, and this ammo box holds holds a hundred rounds. So let me see if I can open this up. But there you go. That 
those are 45 HCP rounds you're looking at right there. So, you know, I can carry 100 rounds in this box, plus all these clips. Let me make sure this is snapped, which I'm sure it's not. But I can carry all these clips, them targets that are back there, that little toolbox, and then, of course, you know, you put this guy back in here like this, and this, let me put this here, but this is where you can see where I cut that extra, that extra square out to raise that ammo box up. And this was an extra piece of foam that they threw in that I didn't need. But anyway, there you go. There's a 45 ACP. There's a 40 caliber Smith & Wesson. It just closes very, very nice. I've got it situated so it... It does that very thing. Let me, I got to hold down on this a little bit. And let me turn this around. I bought this on Amazon. You can get them for like 60 bucks. But I guarantee you that that's a good case. If you're looking for a good case, these Pelican Volt, v, v, this is a it's V200 holding two rounds. And so there, there you are. You know, it's just a, it's just the way it is. And they make lots of other cases too. So, well, that's my review or, or whatever I'm blabbering about for today. And uh, let's see. I can see I'm into this for about seven minutes, which is all well and good. So I'll just hold this up here like this and say goodbye to you folks. And sorry I've been doing YouTube videos lately, but I've had a lot of company I've had a lot of things going on around here, and that's all there is to it. Adios, my friends. Take care of yourselves, and we shall see you on down the trail. Boop.